Hey friends, welcome to Power Code Music. In this presentation, we're going to talk about the Yamaha DM3D 22 channel digital mixer and five things all should know. Yamaha is a brand that knows how to build great mixing consoles. They've been doing it since the 1970s and they have a history of innovative sound throughout the decades that's hard to beat. With this, the company's released a new hardware digital mixing console series that is super compact and portable. This latest solution appears to make high level professional quality digital mixing features even more economical. The DM3 model series features a multi-language user interface that can be configured to make operations easier for users of different backgrounds and skill levels. DM3 mixing consoles offer the power and flexibility to do much more than many may think with a compact digital mixing console. For folks looking to scale down their home studios or live performance rigs, the DM3 could be a real game changer. Without further ado, let's check out five things all should know about the Yamaha DM3D digital mixer. Number one, the DM3 model series. DM3 is currently available in two different model types. These include the first, which is the DM3S. This is the standard model, hence the S after the three, with a suggested retail price of $1,699. The next is the DM3D. This model includes Dante networking technology, hence the D after the three. Its suggested retail price is $1,999. This is Yamaha's first compact console to be fully compatible with Dante technology. The auto setup function of DM3 automatically configures Dante patches for compatible devices in a Dante network. Instead of using external software like a Dante controller, it makes it easier to set up patches between DM3 consoles and devices that are compatible. For those unfamiliar with Dante, this functionality replaces connections to a computer network. It can easily send video or hundreds of audio channels over ethernet cables with pure digital fidelity. The connections are managed via software, which makes routes faster, more readable, and more reliable. Dante functionality in essence is a combination of software, hardware and network protocols and delivers uncompressed multi-channel low latency digital audio signals over a standard ethernet cable using layer 3 IP packets. DM3 includes both primary and secondary Dante port connections along with an additional RJ45 connector or better known as a network connector for ethernet connection to a PC or router. Number two, DM3 does live streaming. We know live streaming has unique technical demands that are often a challenge to manage without additional outboard gear. DM3 has a USB connection that allows users to go live fast. It's paired with features such as matrices, flexible patching, and factory presets that are aimed specifically at making live streaming easier. The unit is equipped with analog IO and USB terminals, making it possible to import audio and transmit that mixed audio directly to a PC with streaming software that's invoked. With stereo and matrices, audio routing provides a high degree of flexibility and allows mixing of audio for on-site and streaming separately. DM3 uses Dante functionality for streaming. With this, devices in a network can be detected and configured automatically, while allowing users to also name devices. Low latency, 
jitter control, and high sample accuracy are achieved via highly precise network synchronization technology. DM3D supports redundant connections in the form of primary and secondary lines, making it resistant to failures, or should I say more resistant to failures. It also allows connections to PCs over the internet and direct in and out of audio without an audio interface device. It offers long distance communications of up to a maximum of 100 meters between devices using a Cat5e network cable. Number three, DM3D is capable of two track and multi track recording. DM3 is not just a digital mixer. It also has the ability to be used as a multi-track recorder. Both DM3 models support multi-track recording via USB to host, while simple two-track recording is also possible using a USB memory stick and the USB connector on the front of both consoles. The Dante equipped DM3 the console, however, also adds multi-track recording capability using the Dante Virtual Sound Card. Dante Virtual Sound Card is a software application that turns Windows or Mac OS X computers into Dante-enabled devices, allowing users to connect to any Dante network. It also enables audio applications on PCs to send and receive up to 64 channels of uncompressed audio to and from other Dante enabled devices, including other PCs running Dante Virtual Sound Card. Dante Virtual Sound Card eliminates the need for expensive sound cards. But keep in mind that the Dante Virtual Sound Card is sold separately and does not come bundled with either model of the DM3 series. Number four, DM3D has control surface and remote control functionality. DM3's DAW remote function allows users to use a range of devices to control their mix and recordings from anywhere in a live venue or recording studio. Those recorded performances can be stored directly to a USB stick, on a PC connected via USB to host, or on a separate Dante compatible device, which is DM3 only. This data can then be edited with a digital audio workstation software application. DAW operations that include volume adjustment, play, and stop can be invoked using the console's faders and buttons as physical controllers for operations during mixdown. Now, switching to DAW remote mode is a simple one-step operation. This can be performed by pressing the custom one and two in the fader bank section together. Many other software applications allow users to control the DM3. These include the DM3 editor. This allows the editing of DM3 parameters for external devices. The second is the DM3 stage mix. This allows remote control of the DM3 from on stage. The last is the monitor mix. This allows each performer to adjust their own monitors. Now at the time of this presentation, DM3 series models are not compatible with the Yamaha Provisioner software. Yamaha says that the application will support the DM3 series in future updates. Number five, DM3D supports VST plugins. VST stands for Virtual Studio Technology. It's an audio plugin software interface that integrates software synthesizers and effects into digital audio workstation software applications. VST and similar technologies use digital signal processing to simulate traditional recording studio hardware in software. 
DM3 series comes with downloadable VST Rack Elements, which is a plug-in hosting software package from Yamaha. VST Rack Elements allows you to integrate effects plugins with the DM3 series or another mixer. Here's a point of note. DM3 series only supports send and return effects plugins, so keep that in mind. To download the VST Rack Elements, users will need to use the download access code on the included Cubase AI download information sheet in the product carton box. The download access code on the sheet provides for the license of VST Rack Elements and Cubase AI. Well, friends, that's a wrap. If you like this presentation, please give it the thumbs up and click the subscribe button on your screen now to join our group. We have new presentations coming out every seven to 14 days, and we would love to have you be a part of our team. Also leave a comment in the comment section. Let us know what you think about this content and check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, and TikTok. Now, while you're here, check out some of the other music and videos, and especially the playlist because they're designed just for you. Thank you so much for stopping by. We really do appreciate it and we look forward to seeing you soon.